Hello, hello. Hi, you guys. Happy Friday. Whenever you happen to be watching this video, I really, I really appreciate your time so very much. I'm Maria. This is the Strong Body, Strong Soul um, page here, but I'm so excited because I'm going to be going through a process on Sunday morning with the beautiful group that I've been involved with for, for many years now, off and on kind of the life gets so hectic. But I'm always reminded of how beautiful this whole process is of life in general. I've invited a couple of friends to come onto the screen with me. I have Jim and Elizabeth here with me, and I want to introduce them to you guys. I've been meditating with these guys. Hi. Hi, you guys. I'm so excited. Thank you so much for taking a few minutes of your time to stop in here with me. We've been meditating at 7 a.m. Pacific Standard Time for me. They are in Idaho, but every morning they are leading a group. Most mornings. It's it's a beautiful thing, the connection that's been forming over the last year with you guys. And um, this Sunday is the manifest. So I wanted to ask you guys on here, if you could let the people watching know kind of, if you could describe what the manifest is on Sunday morning, that would be so fantastic. Sure, well, <clears throat> it's great to have you, have, have you invite us and um, welcome to all of your viewers. Um, <laughs> really happy to be here. Um, the uh the manifest this sunday uh at 8 30 a.m pacific is um manifesting divine divine protection and um it's being led by sri preeta ji which is who's our teacher from southern india and uh she leads a manifest every um once a month for the last year or so 18 months right was kumarji saying it's been 18 months 18 months yeah that's right wow. and um it's a three and a half hour um incredible process there's um processes that happen there's um liberative wisdom that's shared and then sri Pritaji leads us all in her um limitless field meditation which really gr grounds and um, allows that seed of, of wisdom and consciousness to, to sprout and um, manifest in your life. Yes, yes, I love it. And let me explain you guys, we, the three of us, we're just on a big Zoom call right now with Kumarji, who is an amazing monk from India. He does, what are they, evolution calls, right? During the week, he takes his own time to really gift people from all over the globe. There are people, how many people were in the room with us right now, Elizabeth? Almost 200 people. And he's been doing evolution calls ever since the beginning of COVID. And he was doing them nightly. Um, wow. straight from India for an hour every day. And just recently they've changed to once a week on Wednesday evenings at 5 p.m. It's just fantastic. And you know, I'm gonna put a link in the comments here on this particular video so people can find out more information because just like Jim said, they've been doing these manifest events. They're usually three, three and a half hours on a Sunday once a month. And each time they have a different theme Obviously, protection is high on the list for all of us, whether it's COVID or the fires, there's just so much going on in the world. We all need protection. And um, Elizabeth, I thought it was so interesting what Kumarju was reminding us all of about the soul circle. Can yeah. you kind of tell everybody what a soul circle is? Absolutely, thank you, Maria. Um, it's so fun to be on here. It's rare that Jim and I do these things. So this is like, oh, well, and seriously, yeah. I love to do them. We just spontaneously yeah. are having this conversation, you guys, because really just fun. like I was telling you, you know, conversations, that's where such beauty comes out and you don't know what you're going to say. Yeah. It comes straight through. 
for you guys, for whoever's out there listening. I just love it. And feel free to share this video or any of the links that are in the comments here um, with anyone you know. Perhaps you're in our soul circle and we don't even know it, right? It's okay. <laughs> so uh, on that topic of soul circle, it's um, really, it starts with about nine people that are closest to you and they may presently be in your life or they may have been from the past. They may be currently here on the planet and may have left. Uh, but they're people who have made a great emotional impact in your life and who when you think of them it strikes emotion in your heart uh, and you think of them and mm -hmm. in a certain way a powerful way we'll say and so it usually begins with nine people and when we impact our own consciousness it's automatically filtering into our soul circle these nine people Third, start start with your family. That's a good indicator of some mm -hmm. of your soul circle. Mm -hmm. And uh, when you start impacting their consciousness, and that could be through, you know, inviting them to the manifest or not. It can be, again, just by your consciousness shifting, it's automatically rippling and affecting their consciousness. Yes. Wonderfully, though, we have these opportunities to invite people to really go deeper into their own transformation, their own awakening in their consciousness. Because when we impact these nine people and they start living in a beautiful state or in a having a beautiful life, yes. it ripples out to the rest of the world and it's exponential, the impact that it has. Yes. Uh, but it just starts as you being a hub tree. You know, if you look at aspirin, yes. that's exactly how they refer to it is, you're the tree but we're all connected underneath with our roots and that's how we are with our soul circle yes and i can't even say it enough i think that social media and technology is just such a beautiful gift we can get our voices and our energy out there um i think it is amazing i think there is a different feeling to it when it is live as much as as having a podcast i love recording my whole mission is to leave a legacy for my kids so they can feel my energy when i'm not here anymore that's the beauty of recording but for some of these processes that we do in the manifest for instance people all over the world are in there on different time zones and everything and you can feel the energy and i do it was funny because in the zoom call that we were just in like you said it's almost 200 people at the manifest sometimes it's almost a thousand people and it grows from there um in such a beautiful way too you don't know and i i also want to just point out you know that nine people in your soul, soul circle just like you said elizabeth you know my dad passed away several years ago but he's in my soul circle and he's just one of those people that I could have deep conversation with when he was still here. And I still feel his energy now. But there are also people in my soul circle that I've learned from and grown with that are not necessarily in my life, like you said. And it might have ended on maybe I learned something painful from them. And that's okay, too. And that's okay, too. Sure. So I just think it's so beautiful. Um, so every month, you guys, they do the manifest. Some of the other topics in there have been, you know, parenting, I think, has been one, maybe yeah. romance, health, right? Physical health, yeah. um, boosting your immune system, obviously, uh, as was a whole Sunday thing. It's just beautiful. I also want to say... <laughs> It was almost 200 people in that room. And I didn't realize it was that many when I raised my hand, just so you guys know. <laughs> I was like right full in front and center. But the thing that I shared in that room right now that we were in was that I really feel immediate benefits in my family when I come out of the manifest. I do not include them in the manifest. They're not really into it. And that's okay. Just like Elizabeth said, you know, people benefit and everybody, these guys are in Idaho. I'm in Southern California, but I'm telling you what, everybody in between geographically and all over is benefiting from
from this conversation, it's giving the three of us energy, courage, confidence to share this event and to go all in on it even more so. It's just so beautiful. Yeah. Jim, have you been doing all of them, Jim, of the manifest? Um, I think I have, yeah. Elizabeth, wow. no. I think we've been apart maybe once or twice traveling, and we, but we've still been able to do it, both of us. Um, I think we've hit every one of them. Um, That's amazing. Yeah, really will... powerful. And, and I can't say it enough or, you know, deep enough that Sri Pritaji's consciousness is so powerful that um, even though it's an online event, her consciousness is so expansive and vast and and so loving. It's it touches me so so deeply. Um, it's it's amazing. It's like she's in the room. Absolutely, really I agree. Amazing. It's live, but it's through the Zoom. Mm -hmm. It's it, it's amazing. Now, while we're talking about Preeta J, she's coming to the United States in September. Jim, can you tell everybody? what that event is before I let you guys go? Yeah, there's uh, actually, she'll be here for a month or so. Oh. Um, she'll be showing up in San Francisco first, okay. um, just about mid-September. And she'll be doing some really beautiful live um, speaking events there. And then she'll go on to um, Boise. Boise, Idaho, and uh, a really great, some really great venues there uh, speaking engagements and uh kind of the the cream cream of the crop is the uh four day field <clears throat> um field of awakening and that's from the 17th to the 20th uh that's in amazing. valley idaho yeah and that's, that's a live four day event with her it's full on from morning to evening and that actually Elizabeth and I attended, we've been to two or three now, and um, one of them, which um, we ended up getting together at. Um, so- <laughs> And now you're engaged. Now we're engaged. Congratulations. Yeah. <laughs> um, really, really powerful um, experiences, enlighten, enlightenment experiences, um, transcendental experiences, and, and um, that, that are planted seeds planted and and just keep evolving in in our consciousness and beautiful, um, beautiful. and then she moves on to la for uh, about a week and then new york city for another week so wow wow lots of opportunities to see amazing and, and people usually travel they travel a lot to india to go to Ekam for long uh processes for a week and too long things right yeah. um now and I, I i just i went to go see tony robbins several years ago and just so you all realize you know tony robbins studied with preta g and krishna g too yeah. it was so, it's so fun because i've been with akam or oneness some variation of it for a long time and then to be at a, at a tony robbins thing and have him be saying oh he learned all this stuff from them was really amazing really amazing so yes yeah, so, so powerful and impactful he's a student. yes yeah yes 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 and she's so beautiful mm -hmm. um but anyway okay i will let you guys go and i will let you guys go thank you so very much for stopping by do you go ahead is there anything you wanted to tell everybody before i let you guys go i mean we touched on the main meditations at 7 a.m in the morning i guess everybody could come if you want let me know if you want to join yeah you sure can you can leave that uh, zoom id if you like maria anyone's welcome and we really hope to see everybody at the divine protection manifest on sunday at 8 30 a.m pacific yeah and, and i would like to add to if you know if you have four days that you really want to take um a, a very deep spiritual journey and come out a different person, definitely yeah. come out a different person than the FOA in Sun Valley is something that you really should um, consider. And, and FOA is Field of Awakening. Yes. Excellent. Yeah. Thank yeah. Thanks so Thank much. You, you Thank you guys. Yeah. Really. We'll Wonderful. see you in the morning. Yeah. We'll yes. See you really. Okay, bye. <laughs> bye. Take care.
Wow, you guys, aren't they great? I just love those people. They're amazing. All right. Thank you so much for watching. And I will talk to you another time. I'm going to go ahead and put the links in the comments here for you guys. If you want more information on anything that we were just talking about. Have a beautiful weekend. I know I will. <laughs> Bye.